Imagine revisiting the golden era of gaming, Uncharted, God of War 3, The Last of Us, all running flawlessly on your PC. But wait, is that even possible? Yes, and today I'll show you exactly how to set up RPCS3, powerful PS3 emulator ever made, right on your computer. You will need four items for setting up RPCS3 emulator. RPCS3 emulator, PS3 firmware, PS3 game file, and WinRAR. I cannot provide the website in my video due to copyright issues. You can find these items on any browser or read the pinned comment. Emulator and game file will be in zip format by default, but we will extract them with the help of WinRAR. Let's extract RPCS3 and God of War zip file. Right-click on the RPCS3 file and go to the Win RAR dropdown and click here to extract the file. The extraction has been done as you can see on the screen. Now let's extract our game file. Double-click on the file, select this file and click on Extract to Button, and then choose Desktop and click on OK. It will start extracting the game file to the desktop. It's going to take some time to extract. Let's fast-forward the video to save the time. Once it's done, double-click on the extracted file. Select all these files and click on Extract to Button, and then choose Desktop and click on OK. Let's fast forward the video again to save the time. The extraction has been done. Now assemble all these required files in one folder. Open any drive on your computer. Create a new folder by clicking right-click on the screen. Now click on New and then Folder. Name it PS3. Move these two files into the folder as showing on screen. Create a one more folder here. Name it as you like. Move these game files inside this folder. We need only these files to play God of War 3 on RPCS3 emulator. You can delete all other files as showing on screen. We do not require these files now. Now go to RPCS3 folder and open the RPCS3 app. Select these tabs and click on Continue button. Now go to File and then click on Install Firmware. Now go to the location where the firmware is located. Select the firmware and click on Open button. Firmware is installing. After successful installation, this compiling screen will pop up automatically. Let's fast forward the video to save the time. Now go to the File tab again and click on Add Games. Now to go to the location where the game files are located. Select this game folder and click on Select Folder button. Select this option if you want to create a shortcut on the desktop and click on OK. Game has been added successfully. Double click on the game icon to play. It will start compiling. It can take up to 5 to 10 minutes depend on the specification of your PC. Fast forwarding the video to save the time. Our game started running fine. That's it for today's tutorial on setting up RPCS3 emulator on your PC. If you encounter any issue during setup or gameplay, let me know in the comment section. That's it for today's tutorial on setting up RPCS3 emulator on your PC. If you have any question or feedback, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more gaming tutorials. See you in next video.